me see if I can summarize here. We used to call this uh, forward deployed. That'll work. So I work for a little motel. It's reasonably close to home, but with the winter and everything, uh, when I took the solar panels off of the trike, the, um, I wasn't getting enough sun to make it worth leaving the panels on there. So I took them off and then just tripled the battery capacity and then we got enough. Well, then with the darkness that comes in the winter, I would have to leave here at a certain time to get home before dark. And so what we've ended up doing is they've got an extra room that was going to be a break room for the housekeeping people. And then we don't just kind of ignore all that stuff. Anyway, so then the housekeeping, the housekeeping team, both of them quit and uh, I'm the maintenance guy. And so now I've been promoted to also doing housekeeping and maintenance. So today I cleaned four rooms and then fixed the washing machine. So, yeah, the, the key part is I don't have time to go home anymore. I think I've worked 10 or 12 days in a row now or something like that. So it's like, all right, I got food at home and stuff. And then I'm like duplicating everything I got here. And so, you know, it's like, I got to bring a laptop in. And then I bought another coffee maker and had it uh, shipped here instead of going home to find the coffee maker I've got because I haven't had time to go home lately. And then a new battery charger for the bike. So if I ever do get to go home and then I did sneak home and grabbed a bunch of wiring stuff so I can rewire the trike for the new battery charger and then the new batteries that are coming and a uh, new tire for the bicycle that I haven't had time to work on lately. So it's sitting at home and you know, various parts and tools and other tools. And yeah, uh, we keep the air compressor in here for anybody that's got a flat tire, even though there is a tire changing place, literally, you know, that way, but we take care of our people, so we air up tires. Uh, I traded, let's see, this one works. That's the motels one. That one was one of my microwaves. Um, I was cleaning out one of the other storage rooms and we've got three broken microwaves. So I traded my one good one for three broken ones that I can then take apart for, you know, scary science experiments or something like that someday. Um, box full of laundry. Since I fixed the washer, I had to test it. <laughs> I had to test the washer. So ran a load of laundry in it to make sure it works. Okay. And then the confusion. It's like, all right, it's winter time. So we got hot chocolate. That actually is country time. That country time is actually oatmeal. Uh, and then I think, I, I think the price I paid for one of these is about the equivalent of what the little mini mart has at the at the chevron so i'm gonna save that because it's like for what i paid for it I'm, i hate to drink it but now i get the big one brand new coffee maker yay and then i say hot chocolate from that actually is coffee that one is rice that one is beans and then the little crock pot and the little rice cooker that i've had at home and then because I wasn't sure if I was going to be staying here every night or going home half of the nights, I ordered another rice cooker. And so I'm keeping the little rice cooker and the little crock pot here. And then I've got the big rice cooker and the pressure cooker at home, which may or may not get used. And then there's also more rice and more beans at home in case we get there, you know, various stashes of chili and cliff bars and so what i've been doing is when i do order from sam's I'm, I'm, I'm in town anyway so i keep half of it here and then if i do get out to the ranch then i take the rest out to the ranch and then you know yeah and ignore all that that's that's completely different stuff but this is it forward deployed <laughs> If I could see one month into my future at any given time, 
Like, you know, should I fix the bicycle or am I ever going to need the bicycle again because I may never get home, you know, or which pile of tools do I bring in or what am I doing next or yeah. it's a new world. However, income is good. Uh, yeah, when we have a hotel staff of a manager, two housekeeping, and one maintenance, and then the housekeeping division completely quits. Yeah, my income has just tripled in the last week. So, yeah, I'm almost up to back up to the poverty line. This is great. Stay tuned. <laughs>